this video will give you basics on how to put an equation into a Word file. So we want to enter an equation into of a line and I also want to do a quadratic just so that we can see how to use exponents. So all you would do is come in wherever you want to put your equation and we can say insert and then you come over to equation and you can just plug it in there and then you've got all these templates up here. So if I just want to write x plus 5 equals 7 you can just write x plus 5 and it does the spacing for you is equal to 7. It's pretty basic. Okay, now if I wanted to put in a quadratic it's not much different but there's a little bit of work you have to do to it. So you come in here and say equation again but now you see this e to the x that means that we're going to put an exponent in there. So you have to click on it before you even write the term and we want the exponent so it would be this first one. In here you put your base so let's say we wanted 2x squared so I would write 2x in here and then I would click on the little box to put my exponent and then you click outside that so that you can keep writing we need to there. Now you can you barely see it but I have a big cursor now instead of a little one and I should be able to write my minus 8x plus 9 and I can just press enter when I'm ready to get out of that. So the key thing to remember is to use your insert and use equation editor. If you want a fraction you can choose the way you want your fraction to come up. If you want a radical you might need a radical you can do it this way. Parentheses and brackets you don't necessarily have to use that way. Let me just write a nice equation here. You don't necessarily have to use them here. I could just say parentheses 2x equal 9 close the parenthesis or and you can put your spaces in there or you can come in here and if you, you do use these brackets then what happens is they put them there and you oops it moved it over here but you can see what we're doing up here it gives you the both sets of parentheses so you just start writing in there and then you would arrow out if you wanted to get out of there and write something else so if you just do a little bit of playing again that's in insert then you go over to equation and if you just do a little bit of playing around you can figure out um, most of the things that you should be able to do in there if you've got your basic math symbols for your times and divide that you can't find on your keyboard and your infinity if you need that and your plus or minus and then you've got your fraction and your exponent and radical maybe the brackets those are most of the things that we use in in the basic algebra courses and whenever you're done you just press enter and alright so let's say let's do one thing let's just see how it works in here uh, we simplified and then we want to put an equation in here so we do second I mean insert an equation and then we write two or let's, let's make it parentheses. So parentheses 2x plus 1 times a quantity 3x minus 4 and then we can just press enter and you, can, you may have to come back up here if you want to keep going and we got and what would that be? And we can do insert again equation and we got 6x squared and then I forgot my exponent so I'm going to write it now. I can just put the x in. doesn't matter if I put the 6 and the x or just the x. But 6x squared. Make sure I'm in the box. And then make sure I get a big cursor out of that. And it would be uh, minus 8 plus 3 so it would be minus 5x. And then we have minus 4. So you can see how you can put an equation right into a sentence as well.